Russia forming assault units with disabled soldiers, relatives outraged. Russia is establishing so-called disabled units, recruiting soldiers with severe injuries and illnesses into its armed forces to the outrage of their relatives, the Kyiv Post says. According to Important Stories Media, at the end of November, the Russian Ministry of Defense proposed changes to the medical examination procedure for army recruitment. The suggested amendments aim to consider the experience of a military operation and exclude diseases that do not significantly affect the ability to perform military service duties. Consequently, Russian conscripts previously sent to convalescent regiments after sustaining injuries are reportedly being returned to the front lines in assault units without undergoing a military medical commission or receiving adequate medical care. One highlighted case is that of Mikhail who sustained a shrapnel wound in April 2023, resulting in a hole in his leg bone. He was assigned to a convalescent regiment where, according to his wife, he didn't receive proper medical treatment. Ligaments are damaged. Bone is damaged. The hole in his leg is growing every month. There is an inflammatory process, his wife said. She claimed that a traumatologist categorized him as B, without proper examination, meaning with restrictions, he can go. After a subsequent examination, the same doctor assigned him an A category, paving the way for his return to the front lines. Now we're waiting with our suitcases for him to be sent to the front. He has five stumps instead of teeth, and you can't take a blender with you there, Mikhail's wife said. When she asked how he is going to eat there, the doctor replied, the stew is soft there. In 14 months, my handsome strong man turned into an old sick grandfather. They just ruined a man, just like me, his wife, the woman added. According to the report, several hundred individuals are awaiting deployment to the front lines in the regiment of convalescents in the Kantamirov division. From there, cripples are sent back to the front line every day, lame, oblique, toothless, the wife of the Russian soldier said.